Hey there, welcome back to my channel. I'm so happy that you guys are here with me today. Today's video is going to be hopefully the first episode installment of a drugstore series I'm hoping to do on my channel. I'm going to be doing best at the drugstore, but I'm going to be moving on to different categories. So we're going to be doing foundations, primers, highlighters, blushes, bronzers. We're going to be doing all of that, but today we are going to be doing foundations. I know that there are a lot of makeup tutorials out there that feature loads of high-end products and I do this myself so I figured that I would do something different and give you guys affordable drugstore options so I went through all of my foundations today and I picked out my top favorite drugstore foundations I'm not sure if I'm the first one to be doing this on YouTube um, I'm not taking credit for this idea whatsoever. I just thought it would be something fun to do to give you guys affordable makeup options so without further ado Let's go ahead and get started. Let's start, let's get talking about some foundations. The first foundation that I wanted to mention in this video is from Physicians Formula. It's their Healthy Skin Foundation. It retails for $12.99 and it has 16 shades in their shade range. And this foundation does have SPF 20. I feel like this is a really great foundation for the summertime and it is a great foundation for any time of the year but especially during the summer when it is super hot you want to make sure that your skin is protected and it has SPF 20 in it. Now I don't know about you guys but if I'm just going out on the daily like running errands I'm not going to put on a layer of sunscreen. It's just not me. Um, if I'm going swimming or I know I'm going to be out in the sun a lot I will but for those every day I mean I know that I should but this foundation kind of helps me apply sunscreen without really knowing it and it is super lightweight that's one of my favorite things about this foundation I can layer this foundation I can put one and a half to two layers of foundation on my skin and it doesn't feel heavy that it doesn't get heavier as you apply it it just feels like you applied a light layer of foundation it has a beautiful satin luminous finish to it and I love these finishes I live for it I wear luminous dewy satin foundations Pretty much 99% of my life it has a great um, wear time on it I am actually wearing it right now it just looks really beautiful and natural but you're getting the coverage that you need generally it does provide medium to full coverage you can build it up if you'd like I don't experience any cakiness it doesn't crease in my smile lines it's just a bomb foundation for a really great price the next foundation I wanted to share with you guys is from flower beauty it is their light illusion foundation this retails for $12.99 and I believe it has 12 shades in the shade range and one of the reasons I really really like this foundation is because kind of like the physicians formula it has a beautiful dewy finish to it and it's lightweight and it really looks natural now I would say that there is a difference between this one and the physicians formula this one is going to provide a lighter amount of coverage you can build it up um, I think generally it does give you light to medium coverage I just really like it on these light makeup days I can just throw this on it makes my skin look really healthy very dewy and it brightens my complexion so I think it is one of those foundations where if you want to apply a light layer it's going to give you coverage but it'll leave your freckles your freckles will still be showing through it's going to give you that general easy fast coverage that you need especially if you're in, in the morning you're trying to get ready in a hurry this is a good foundation to throw on all right so let's move on to another foundation um, this is one of my favorites like all of these are this is the Maybelline dream satin liquid foundation it was recently released from Maybelline maybe one to two months ago um, this does come in 12 shades and retails for $9.99 so very affordable like all of the foundations in this video this has a beautiful satin finish as you can tell I am obsessed with satin foundations apparently um, it, I just can't help it but this is a very nice foundation. It has a medium to full coverage. It is buildable. I'd say the only con to this foundation is it is not very long wearing. So when I know that I want to wear this, I usually pair it with a super good foundation primer and I'm good to go. I like to wear this foundation when I'm doing like an everyday glam. So it is a little bit more full coverage than the other foundations that I've mentioned. So when you're wanting a little bit more coverage, but it's not gonna look too cakey, this is a good foundation to go for. And moving on, I have the CoverGirl True Blend Matte Made Foundation. I think I did do a first impressions and wear test on this foundation. So it is a newer foundation from CoverGirl. And finally, a foundation I've talked about that has a matte finish. So this foundation retails for $8.99 and comes in 40 shades. 
This foundation does have a matte finish. It's not a harsh matte finish where it makes you look really crusty and ew. It has that very nice soft matte where it's gonna really blur out your pores and give you that flawless looking skin, but it's not going to overdo it where it dries out your skin, makes your complexion look dull. The foundation is super long wearing. It will last all day. So on those days when I'm like, dang, my makeup really needs to last long today. I need it to stay in place, stay on my face. This is a good foundation to go for. It's just really good. And that is it. Those are all the foundations that I have to talk about today. I hope that you guys enjoyed. Definitely let me know what your favorite drugstore foundation is and why. I would love to know. You guys have a fantastic day. Thank you so much for watching. Jesus loves you so very much. And I will talk to you in my next video. Bye, guys.